right in that boxing stance. Elbows are nice and tucked. As we step forward, we never ever want our feet to come together. So you want to push off that back foot and step forward, front back. When we step back, you push off your front foot and step back, back front. So we have step forward, step back, step forward, step back. Now, as you step from side to side, your feet never cross, so always want to make sure you have that distance. So, as you step towards that lead foot, you step lead, then back. As you step towards that back foot, you step back, then lead. So you have step side, step side, again, and one more time. So. Hey guys, um, so today we're going to talk about our footwork, we're going to cover shuffling a little bit more. So we really want to think when we're shuffling, hands stay up, elbows stay in, I want to be in my stance. So I want to make sure I'm light on my feet, I'm not super heavy, so when I shuffle forward, I want to try and push off that back foot as I come forward. When I take it back, same thing, super light feet, I'm pushing off that front. Main thing on my shuffle is that I'm keeping my feet equidistant, so I'm never going to open up super big to shuffle, I want to stay right underneath. And then if I shuffle out to the side, I want to come into a parallel stance. So feet are right underneath my hips. I'm going to push off one foot, shuffle to one side, and then reverse it, shuffle to the other. And if I want to try and get a little bit more uh, rest, maybe I'll take it backwards a little, I'll dance around. I want to make sure in that shuffle, I'm nice and light as I move forward, back, open up that stance to the side and to the other side. Final component of footwork, number three, will be pivoting. So hands are up high, let's get in that boxer stance. Just a little quarter turn towards your lead foot or your back foot. First things first, we'll go towards our lead foot. So to pivot towards the lead, you step on that lead foot and then swing that back foot behind you to land in that boxer stance. I'll get back in center. Let's reverse that. Towards our back foot, you step with that lead foot and then rotate all the way to the side then I get right back in my boxing stance. So once again, your feet never cross. You leave that lead foot planted, you rotate, and you rotate. 